recognizing my look. Why are you not recognizing my look? I can. No, I need that. I need that. <laughs> Why are you not recognizing my webcam, sir? Please. My, my webcam is in fact plugged in, sir. Why are you not showing, sir? Um. <laughs> I'm trying. Hi, everyone. I'm trying to figure out why and uh, why on earth my webcam isn't showing. <laughs> Everything is breaking. Pain. Here, let's try. <laughs> why is this not displaying, sir? Are you. Why is this not displaying? Um. <laughs> that was entirely on me. I can't even be mad. I never gave that much of a fuck about it. I just think that I, me and Shoji have joked about how like I could pick the stupidest way to dox myself, and I think I, I think I I held up my end of the bargain on me making sure it's the stupidest way. I I, I did my part. <laughs> okay, um, I'm trying to figure out what the fuck right now because it is. Ignoring my stream cam, and I don't know why. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> oh shit, I gotta text Shirge like, hey, I did it. <laughs> what do, okay, well that is wonderful and all. Why the fuck is my stream cam? Oh wait. Oh, I think I know what, I, know, I think I know what happened. Logitech, Logitech, I forgot I installed their fucking hub. <laughs> <laughs> because I was recording for a fucking school project and Logitech wasn't doing what it was supposed to be doing so I ended up like doing I installed it's like proprietary software thing you know I it, it really puts a damper on the stream when I can't get to you know the main part of the stream to function Logitech I think it's going alright task manager do me proud here <laughs> Okay, says Streamlit. Logitech, what the hell? So how's everyone's day going as I continue the trend of never having anything work? Okay, it says it's running. Oh, it says it's running like six times. What the fuck? Oh, man. <laughs> we don't need this day to come. <laughs> Pain. End task, end task, end task. End task. End task. End task. Oh god, it's like re-multiplying. End task. <laughs> Good morning, Gummy. <laughs> My hair is wet and I... Okay, so whilst I try to figure this out, um, I took a shower a little bit too late. My hair was still wet, so I was like, fuck it, we'll do a sewing stream because my hair takes like three hours to dry properly and I don't want to get the sketchbook wet. And I have all of my stuff here ready to go, and then my webcam happens. <laughs> um, so, oh, how come you work? Um, I, oh my god, is that the fucking problem? Is that the fucking problem? Okay, so, let's delete that. Go back to here. That was the fucking problem. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so the problem was simply the fact that I had my fucking thing open on a different a scene, and apparently that really makes the stream cam angry. <laughs> okay, so now that the first issue is solved, uh, let me readjust this. <laughs> Out of all the problems today, I'm just I I'm not allowed to be free of problems. There's all I ha there has to be a problem. <laughs> Is this doing okay? Yeah, this is, I could make this shorter, actually, I think. Like a bit. Yeah, there we go, that works. <laughs> Universe went, nah, bitch. You're, you're happening. <laughs> I, Jesus Christ. 
Someone remind me to text Shoji later, like, yeah, I was the dumb bitch. I did it. It happened. <laughs> okay, so. And that's where we go to the next part of the scuff, because it never ends. <laughs> I was going to do my little trebuchet plushie that I started, and I cannot figure out where in the fuck I put her pieces. But honestly, I still want to sew things, because I have a problem, and I don't know, I just woke up today and went, I want to sew something. That's where my mood is right now. <laughs> oh no, Shoji called this. I'm not going to live it down, because Shoji fucking called this ages ago. <laughs> Let me see, what do I have here? Uh, here, first I guess I'll show off my trinket hoard, the queen of scuff. You know what, in a way it is garbage. <laughs> Here we go. So let us first pull out, this is what I like to call the I have a problem pile, in which I like to take, whenever I see a cool thing in the sewing section, I feel the need to own it. So I have a catacophony of trinkets. Um, these are eyes for dragons, and I apparently that was not closed. There's buttons, there's more buttons. Here's magnetic buttons. We can make something magnetic. I have a little charm with a turtle on it that's just a turtle. <laughs> a Velcro, more buttons, and then little noses. I want to make a Pokemon, but I also just wanted to show off just the amount of stuff that I just, I just hoard for no reason. It took two years. <laughs> Honestly, I, I'm proud it took two years. I was careful for two years, and my dumb ass just managed to, you know, be professionally idiotic. <laughs> Here, so let's throw this ball back in. Well, bam. But yeah, I want to make a Pokemon or like Jelly Bean. Um, this was this was a red herring because I don't know if we're gonna be using too much of this. I might use the magnetic buttons. It'd be cute to make something that like you know close its hands. That'd be pretty cute. Mm. This is this is uh, sewing from start to finish. Mm. Because I don't know what the fuck happened to my trubbish plushie that I started. I I have all the thread here. <sighs> For it. I, I prepared for Trubbish. <laughs> Hi, Penny. Playing exams. Honestly, I'm still, like, recovering. I feel, I feel better today. It also helps that I just took a shower and I have some errands. So, like, my brain is, like, in I'm leaving the house mode. <laughs> Ooh, Trubbish. <laughs> Listen, I actually, like, I love Trubbish. It's one of my favorite Pokemon. I think it's adorable. <laughs> And I do want to make it. I want to finish sewing it. I, just, I think I put it in a box in my closet. Except I, I've been putting off going through my closet. Put this back over. So it's literally just a matter of I can't find things. I might make a jelly bean, actually, if I can find the correct felt for her. Because I have all the black I need. That's like an immediate given. I have yellows in here. This is my giant pile of fabric, by the way. This isn't even all my fabric. This is just the felt. This is just the felt of the fabric. Exams. Mood. <laughs> Honestly, Rose, some mood. I, I've been so fucking dead. Here's some extra. Oh, this is from when I made Rico. There's the extra parts from Rico. That is my Archin plushie I made. See what colors do we have? We have a lot. If you have a Pokemon you want to see me make, just shoot it up. It's like shoot it down there in the fucking chat, because I don't know if I have the colors for a proper jelly bean. I could use a brown. I could use brown. You be like, I want to see brown would work. Do I have enough brown though? Let me see. How much brown do I have? Even if I don't do it today, I mean, I like sewing, and we're here. This is this is our long haul. Okay. Yeah, no, jelly bean really is only two colors. Three with the fucking eyes. I'm gonna find like an orange to make it like spicy. What color yellow? That was like a pretty bright yellow. Do I wanna do the, I don't wanna do the orange, I don't think. We're not gonna do the orange. Okay, let me remove my giant pile there. <laughs> and then our final step is we are going to open our little notebook. And this is the only part that's gonna feel like a sketchbook stream. <laughs> What's up, George? <laughs> wormy, oh, we could make a wormy. Oh, that'd be super cute. <laughs> New and random entirely. I have so many random like parts and gadgets, and I want to f I, I I want to sit down and like really think about like what I could make with all of them. So many parts and gadgets. Pig. I do love pigs. Pigs are fantastic. <laughs> wormy is definitely on the fucking list. I want to do a wormy at some point. This is our little reminder thingy. A pig there too. I feel like pig is a valid option. <laughs> what are you supposed to do a day in baconing? <laughs> this is our trubbish. 
I want to do a jelly bean. I want to do a jelly bean today because I've, I've wanted to make a jelly bean plush for so long and I just never sit down and do it. <laughs> this is also where you're going to see that, well, I honestly, I guess for most people it really wouldn't matter, but this is where I also will probably upset a lot of, you know, professional seamstresses because I do not make patterns in the way I probably should. Interesting. And baconing, what have you done? I want to know what you've done. <laughs> I am so intrigued. I want to see. <laughs> Alright, so first let's draw a jelly bean. Can you see the pen marks? Not very well. Here, let me get a let me get my big pen. Big pen. I threw it into my fucking art box like a ruffian. It's my own fault. Because I am a ruffian. Okay. Make it so you actually could see what I'm fucking doing. <laughs> Is that visible? Here. We're getting there. Not there. Okay, so this is where we are. Mm. Right before I make it. I'm intrigued. I mean, I can. I I trust that I won't regret it. <laughs> so let's draw a little jelly bean first. We gotta get our little reference down. Which is literally just the most simple cat physically possible with some horns. The horns are going to be the interesting part of making, making her. Him. I genuinely forget what gender Jelly Bean was supposed to be. I think it's somewhere in like my debut notes, but like I do not. All I remember is that when I went to, uh, when I went to actually. Like, when I was making the models, we were so close to when you set our debut date, and I was randomly just like, I want a cat. And Shoji was like, please, no, you do not have, we don't have time for that. What's up, friend? <laughs> Bless. Drawing is a lot of fun. I really do, like, it's really fun. <laughs> There's our little jelly bean. But he was like, please, no, we have so much to do, you do not have time for cat. And that's why the website says illegally obtained a cat, because I still did it anyways, because I said I play by my own rules and I want a cat. Make <laughs> a signature and all that. All right. I will do that when I'm back at my drawing tablet. <laughs> anyways, so here is our jelly bean. The only, this is a pretty simple like color palette at least, because jelly bean is just three colors. The tail and the wings and the horns are black, and then the body is like a brown purple color, and then the eyes are yellow. And that's Jelly Bean. J just for a refresher, in case you're not looking at the side of my model, that's Jelly Bean. <laughs> What's up, PND? Honestly, yeah, I like draw it really is just a fun hobby. <laughs> yeah, and I again, like my hair is wet right now. I, I'm sure everybody has seen now that my hair is wet because fantastic. I you, I have so many brain cells. <laughs> Shoji's going to fucking roast me. He's going to roast me. I'm going to finish stream and somebody's going to tell him and he's just going to roast the crap out of me. It's my own fault. <laughs> it's my own fault. Bless her. Thank you. There's a slight delay because my phone is, I don't know where I put it. But anyways, um, how I'm trying to think about how I want to approach Jelly Bean. There's two, you already told him, oh no. <laughs> Hi, Melissa. <laughs> really tiny too. <laughs> Everyone knew this day was coming. It's in everything you imagined. <laughs> Frankly, that's exactly how I imagined it going. Or I, I honestly, my biggest thought was I was going to knock over the webcam doing a cooking stream. I thought that was going to be how it happened. <laughs> okay, so we have Jelly Bean. Do we want to do Jelly Bean sitting or standing up? We're trying to decide what would be easier to draft for a pattern. I think standing up would be easier. Oh, man, but sitting would be cute. Sitting would be easier for the balance. It's like, because I also have pellets. I have little plastic pellets you use for making like Beanie Babies and weighted plushies. Uh, here, I have an example, actually. For example, guys, this is Rico. I think we've seen him before. I sewed him. <laughs> you were expecting Greg to do it? <laughs> Honestly, that's big fair. I thought I actually, oh God, no. I Where was he going that I had to like freak out and go run after him? That was when I expected. Hi, Mina, what's up? <laughs> that was what I expected to happen. Yeah, this is Rico. Um, 
his body here, like underneath, this has pellets in it to weight him, so his face doesn't knock him forward. <coughs> I'm sorry there. <laughs> but, yeah, so he stays sat back because I weighted him down. So it's a matter of, do I want to do a standing jelly bean and do four different weights in the paws, or do I want to do a sitting jelly bean and only have to worry about weighting down the body? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Scoop. Honestly, I think the biggest part of there's a couple reasons why I wouldn't I'm just not like a normal face cam streamer um, One is because I am a gigantic weeb and I think it's fun having a anime avatar But also it's just the fact of I don't have to worry about like, you know looking presentable or you know Not scratching my nose on camera <laughs> I am a goblin and I can just pretend I am like a you know cool anime goblin rather than you know The dingus who threw on a green day shirt and said, okay time to go <laughs> I am sitting jelly bean would be cute. It would be. And it honestly might be easier. So now it's just a matter of how do I want to draft sitting jelly bean? For a wall weebs. <laughs> oh, custom FP. Honestly, making plushes is super fun, but it also could take a really long time. <laughs> Stick your whole sticking your whole can you put your whole fist in your mouth? Who can do that? Who who can do that in chat? <laughs> That is the question now, is can you, uh, actually now I want to do two jelly beans side by side. So we're going to put this, we're going to put the notebook like this. Also, shout out to this notebook cover. It's the official Shiranui Flair, like from her first, was it her first Annie or her second Annie? No, it was her third. It was her third anniversary. I don't touch grass. Okay, so we're going to do two, two jelly beans here. We need to do a side and a front, just so I have a better idea of what we're working with. So like, yeah, sitting's gonna be harder to pull off is my only concern. It's just a matter of like, ah oh man, how well can I pull off the shape? It's easier to wait, but harder to initially like conceptualize. So like side jelly bean would be like that with the horns and then, you know, the face and the happy. Or do I, oh uh, no, I could, I, Jelly Bean's face is more flat, I think. Jelly Bean's face would be more flat. Like, I don't know if like fully pancake. <sighs> Bless Justin. <laughs> Honestly, like, I don't know, can I do it? Oh. Woof woof. Okay, so apparently I can, good to know. <laughs> That's my fun fact of the day for myself, apparently. I, I apparently can stick my whole fist in my mouth. <laughs> There you go. Uh, lockjaw sounds terrifying. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Odin. That that sounds absolutely terrifying. <laughs> I have seen your shiny Metagross Plus. Yes, I also remember that we both kept naming. We both named our favorite Pokemon Rico, and I still think it's hilarious. <laughs> All right, guys. You guys got my new model reveal today. <laughs> It's idiot just got out of the shower and didn't think to prepare a webcam beforehand. Hmm. Uh, why did I do that sideways? I need to do it front ways. Okay, uh, frankly, front ways doesn't matter too much. So if I wanted to do shapes for this, hmm, probably that. Maybe like a circle for, yeah, I probably have to do the legs coming out separate. So I'd, hmm, if I really wanted to do a body shape, it would have to be shaped like an actual bean. I'm thinking like an actual bean, hind leg, and then maybe attach the leg to the leg. Oh, man, we're just, we're drafting right now. Drafting is the hard part. <laughs> to make it yourself. My parents gave it to me. <laughs> Honestly, Justin, you're a very hard worker and I really appreciate this. I am just appreciate and impressed. Why did I start? God damn it. I have one brain cell, singular brain cell, one brain cell, one brain cell, one brain cell. So yeah, like a bean. So you're going to do a bean. I'm seeing like bean shape, circle leg, but we're probably do like, yeah, like circle leg like that. 
And then for the front legs, it, they're going to have to come off the side regardless. So like that. I'm not going to get around the fact that I'm, I don't know, do I want to put them more front-wise? Yeah, we're going to have to kind of measure out a little bit. I'll put the put the legs a little bit more front-wise for the bean. For Jelly Bean's actual face, I mean, Jelly Bean's always just been like that. Um, if I really, I really want to do like a more cat-like face, do like this, and then do the ears and the horns, but that doesn't look quite Jelly Bean. That doesn't look quite Jelly Bean. That looks, that looks like a different animal. <laughs> Jelly Bean's charm is the fact that Jelly Bean is drawn like a fifth grader. <laughs> Your parents are amazing artists. <laughs> my grandma is the artsy one, actually, although my mom is also super into crafts. She homeschools my other siblings, and she actually ran a daycare for several years. She was always in like really into the arts and crafts parts of it. She loved making her own stuff. <laughs> <sighs> Yeah, she got out of bed today. That's a mood. Honestly, I woke up. No, I woke up at, oh God, after my after the stream last night, I ended like 30 minutes before I usually would because I had like, I developed like the worst headache out of nowhere. And I finished stream and Tech Dean like got me as, I asked him, as I laid in the couch with like a pillow over my head because light was hurting my eyes. And I was just like, please bring me some ibuprofen. So he did, you know, except he gave me two pill I'd never seen before, which I know sounds fantastic when I say it out loud, but uh, I, he said here, and I was like, two of them? Because one ibuprofen knocks me, makes me sleep for like three hours. I have a, I'm very sensitive to it because I never really take it to begin with, but also I'm just, I am a little bitch. And he was like, yeah, and frankly, my head hurt too much and I felt terrible, so I was just like, whatever, and I took them. It was two extra strength Tylenol for the person who can barely handle one ibuprofen. I, I slept from like 8 p.m. to 2.30 a.m., I think. And then I slept again after I woke up, but oh, I'm awake. And didn't wake back up until like 8 something. <laughs> I'm gonna get roasted. I'm gonna get so roasted. <laughs> yeah, so like it's this. If I wanted to turn that that way though, it would be like a this. Oh God, I've never had to think about jelly beans sideways before. Like, I never contemplated jelly beans sideways. <laughs> how, do I, how do I draw jelly beans sideways? God. It's, you know the dog and Coco? Um, the dog and Coco, what the animators did was there was a rule that every angle he had to look cute, not what was accurate. So a lot of the angles in Coco could not be recreated. The horns are the easy part, at least. The horns just looked like this sideways. And actually, no, fuck, you're right. Um, actually, no, they could look like this front ways. The face is the hard part. I've always drawn Jelly Bean like a three-fourths angle, and it's weird seeing Jelly Bean in any other angle. Oh my god. <laughs> the stream is cursed for a variety of reasons. I think I would just have to like do that and make it like half bean shaped. I will be detailing the little blushies on. I'm just going to do that with thread, though. Okay, this kind of works. We're kind of getting... That's kind of... God, it's just... Hmm. Am I better off just doing a circle? With, like, a triangle on the end? That might be our best solution here. Guys, I never actually thought about jelly beans sideways until now. I don't know what I was going to do when we did, like, any kind of 3D models. Um, I guess that means you can cross that off the bingo card for what things I have cooked up. Okay, I think I, that would work. That would work. Just do like an off form circle and that should work. <laughs> uh, for the toes, I'm going to be using needle sculpting as well because it's easier than trying to individually sew toes. So we're going to be needle sculpt sculpting the toes. The wings are self-explanatory. That's easy enough. And then we have our basic like body shape. How I want to approach our bean shape is probably, hmm. How I want to approach our bean shape, I want to be able to give it like depth. We're gonna do three pieces for the bean shape. Where, where's Rico? Rico is a good example of my shapes. Rico is a good example. <laughs> 
Oh, you could have had jelly bean. Where near the ear? Honestly, I just gotta stick him on the front of the face. <laughs> Shoji's laughing his ass off right now. I expected nothing less. We all expected this day to come. <laughs> I just, I think my one regret is that it's after I took a shower and did nothing with myself. And, you know, not a day where I stream, like, right before I'm going somewhere. <laughs> oh, Dean still doesn't even have a back. Fucking mood, though, honestly. Okay, so. We're gonna do three shapes. Actually, no, I had to do Rico different. It ended up, like, the back shows more because the back is where I wanted. You can kind of see the seams on Rico's back, how they're like this. It's because I wanted to make sure he wasn't one-dimensional. So I added a third piece to kind of widen him. So we're probably going to be doing that. Here you go, Rico. You can go back there. He's my sewing buddy. He's next to me for all my projects because he's my sewing buddy. <laughs> a hot dog, a taco? Uh, no, mainly because hot ta uh, tacos have hard shells in most cases. There are some with soft shells, but I cannot consider the shell of a hot dog the same as like a shell for a taco. <laughs> We're, we're taco purists in this household. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get different thread too, fuck. I, I got all my trubbish thread out. Actually, I still need the black thread so he can stay. I have a sewing box, like 30 different threads. <laughs> Quesadilla. I can, I guess I, ah, uh, no, because quesadillas are also flat. Okay, so next up, I just put that fucking marker. This is not my day, man. Did I knock off? This is just not my day. Under here, no, where did I put, where the fuck did I just put that marker? Under here. I'd be back at my sewing box and I'd just be stupid. I think I am just stupid. Oh no, it's not here. Um, fuck it, we're using a dread. Where did that go? I, oh, it did fall on the floor, it fell on the floor. There you go. Fabric marker. <laughs> I'm not smart. <laughs> Sandwich. I can accept it as a, like a, yeah, because some subs aren't cut all the way through, like a meatball sub. Morning, Ember. Oh, yeah, I made the fourth be with you. I forgot. <laughs> all right, so let's start preparing our felts here because I like sewing. I like sewing with felt because it's just sturdier and deals with my shit more. If you sew with something like Minky, it is way less, like, forgiving, and you have to be a lot more precise with, like, how it folds, basically, because Minky is very... I want to say malleable, which is, it can be a good and a bad thing. This is more like, I would, I would liken this to like using construction paper versus like printer paper. <laughs> All right, it is May 4th. It is my day off of work. After this, I have like a billion errands to run, but I just wanted to spend the morning doing something fun and relaxing. <laughs> With nachos, but not quesadillas. Uh, my school had a very like predominant, like, Latino, Hispanic population. Uh, we didn't really do a lot of food for them, though. <laughs> Honestly, we just like the standard, like, boring pizza. It was like the only school lunch I can remember for some reason. <laughs> for Jelly Bean's face, uh, how do I want to think about this? How do I want to think about this? That is the general face shape. We have our general face shape. I'm doing this on my water bottle. Kinda. There we go. Focus it so everybody can see. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, I forgot they did that weird preschool thing. Okay, so. Jelly Bean's face is mainly just a circle, and it's pretty much established to be kind of flat at this point. I might do, like, a stitch, like, cut, like, a little thing and, like, stitch the center to give it a little bit of texture. I don't, or I can do the top of the, uh, I could just split the top of the head. I need to just split the top of the head. That way she has like more shape to her. I don't know if I want to though. How much shape do we want to give Jelly Bean? I honestly, this is doing great and making me consider the shapes of my cat. <laughs> She'll use white rice. See, I don't, I don't know. I like brown rice. Like if I get like chipotle or something, I use brown rice. Uh, at home, um, I have both kinds though because I like to make like random lazy stir fries and I just throw some rice in the rice cooker to go with it. 
But like I, I, I'm typically fine with most rice, ex- except for like really cheap uh, takeout places here will use like the yellow rice. Except it always gets me sick, so I always avoid it because it gives me like a, I don't know why, it just gives me a massive stomach ache like every time. <laughs> okay, so jelly bean, kind of flat. Mm. I think I'm gonna keep the little rounded side. I think we're I think we're just accepting the fact that jelly bean is like a little rounded side. <laughs> So let's go ahead and get some shapes like done out. First of all, we can make jelly bean pretty decently sized because we have enough we have enough felt for it. We have to pay for PB and J. We had to pay for all of our lunches at school. <laughs> there was like free lunch for like kids who qualified for it. I was not one of the kids who qualified, and I was, was I? It sounds depressing, but before my parents like split, uh, we did not. But I think we did after. <laughs> um, let's see. I think just a circle for Jelly Bean's head with like the little divot side thing. And I know it's probably really hard to see the fabric marker. I apologize. It's like the general shape. I'm going to make it a bit bigger though, probably. So let's go ahead and I'm going to, I really do not do this as I probably should. I just kind of roll with it and go, okay, this is what we're doing. Can you see me cutting? You kind of can. Here. Now you can see me cutting. Cutting around to make it a bit bigger. Another big thing, if you ever want to take up sewing, is remember your seam allowances. This basically is how well you can hide your, like, sewing when you flip it inside out. Like, hide the thread. No, it needs to be a little subtle okay it's like a pretty basic jelly bean head shape <laughs> oh giant easter egg someone giant easter egg <sighs> yeah 15 i graduated like Oh god, it's been a while. It has been a fucking minute, so like I do not remember what we had for school lunches. Oh god, memories. Okay, so there's Jelly Bean's basic head shape. Hmm. I'm still on the fence of what to split it or just keep it like the back what has the thing, because for the most part Jelly Bean is I think we'll split the head a bit so it has a bit of a curvature to it. Because it's not like Archon. Archon has like a, I don't know. And then I want to cut this again, so we're going to take a pin. <laughs> there we go. So let's take a pin, bam, and we'll bam. And then another pin. And then we're going to bam and bam and we're going to cut a second version of that so we have both sides I'll probably do my adjustments later when I finally make up my mind but for now we are going to just cut our fabric pieces <laughs> I'm gonna get roasted as soon as I get off the stream I'm gonna check my phone and I'm gonna have Shoji going, you fucking idiot, I knew it would happen. <laughs> that's, that's the draw of today's stream. Idiot VTuber forgets that webcams are dangerous. <laughs> On the bright side, I mean, I don't really do anything that's like, I would consider like an embarrassment to the family, although my family re really doesn't give a shit. <laughs> it's like, I'm not too concerned. I'm more just waiting for the social backlash in which all of my friends make fun of me. <laughs> okay, I see Dami messaged me. I just checked my phone. <laughs> Honestly, I, don't, I have my college ID memorized because I'm still in college and, you know, I need that. But, like, I do not have my high school one. <laughs> Okay, so I, I was roasted. I will respond to the roasts later, but just understand that I was indeed roasted. 
And then for jelly bean, um, I'm going to put the head there because I need to make sure we're doing a body proportionate to the head. And we're doing a sitting jelly bean, which means like this. Maybe the jelly bean shape around that. Yeah, around that size. <laughs> Your elementary ID. <laughs> I honestly, I just, I have, like, I'm just impressed you remember your elementary ID because I do not. I, although I changed schools a lot growing up, uh, a lot of moving around. So, like, I don't know. I don't really have a strong memory of a lot of the IDs and stuff. I just remember, like, cringy moments from when I was in, like, middle school because you never forget your cringy moments in middle school. Uh, I remember when, I think I told the story when I was a freshman in high school in the sewing class that I thought the student was the teacher and I embarrassed the crap out of myself. <sighs> what are some other ones? Oh my god. Oh, when I was a freshman, I had this fucking mushroom haircut. And it looked terrible and I never would do it again. But like, I had this mushroom haircut. I'm gonna have to have, you know, the necklines, which I don't know. I think I'll have like this and this for my necklines. And then the jelly bean shape goes like this. Okay. And then I wanted that as well. Okay. Got that. A bit big around the legs. This looks a bit skewed. No. No about that either. Jelly bean shoot first. It's because it's not far enough on the back direction I think the good news is this is this is a fabric marker that is air soluble so like you know I'm not ruining my life by doing it a billion times it just takes forever to like dry <laughs> different school each grade honestly a mood I think I had like I had two elementary schools I think I had three yeah three middle schools I think two or three no three I had three middle schools and then I did go to one high school. By that point, we uh, we stayed put. Memories. Okay, I'm thinking that would be that. I think that'll work. Be a little bit chibi. I got the fucking seam allowance, god damn it. I'm gonna be a fucking idiot. I'm gonna have to recut this with the seam allowance. I'll use this for the ears since it's small enough. Because you never waste fabric. Fabric waste is bad. Okay, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Today is just not a great presentation of my intelligence. <laughs> Like, today is the definition of not great for my intelligence. There we go. Put this here for a second. Because, mm. yeah, that'll be... And we're sitting the cat down. Maybe that? No. That. It's like that. Okay. So, like, we're gonna have the very top of the head the connecting point which means I need to do our bean shape here with that in mind I'm gonna do our bean shape in the corner it's always good to use the corners first leaves you with more options don't be a dipshit like me and forget this rule 90% of the time <laughs> I like to give a lot of seam allowance just to be safe although it really depends on how big the thing you're making is too <laughs> Need to make sure we give a little bit of neck for our jelly bean. Jelly beans need necks to grow. 
Although I don't think Jellybean will ever get big. Fun fact, and a real life friend, uh, I didn't speak to her for a while. Like, you know, we just kind of fell out of touch. Um, I talked to her uh, after like a year of like just not seeing each other and she told me, oh, I got a cat, a little black cat named Jellybean. Pure coincidence, absolutely hilarious. <laughs> when did you wake up at two i woke up at two and then fell back asleep like that the extra strength tylenol kind of ruined my life i also missed uh taking my medicine because i fell asleep so early and i had to take it late <laughs> but that's easy enough to fix <laughs> do, 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 do. What the fuck was I doing? I was cutting the second half of the body. That's what the fuck I was doing. Okay, so these two are gonna have... Oh, it looks like a weird fetus. I'm gonna do this this way. Don't really need that anymore. Because we're not sewing yet. That's just extra piece. That's extra piece. I'm gonna go out. We're gonna go ahead and stab the crap out of ourselves. And once we're done stabbing the crap out of ourselves, we're gonna go ahead and pin this into place so we can go ahead and cut our second part. Always make sure when you're pinning as well that you are pinning in a way that keeps the fabric flat, or at least as flat as you can manage, and make sure you're pinning enough. You don't want this moving around as you're cutting. Same thing applies when you're actually sewing the pieces. Make sure you have enough down so it's not going to fly everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, jelly bean is going to be sitting down. <laughs> okay, so we have, our, we have our bean shape, and then we have some fabric at the top to attach the head to. And this is my thread scissors. Why am I using my thread scissors? I am... T this is not my strongest morning. <laughs> yeah, I was roasted. Hey, 9 a.m. is a really natural way. Like, it's a, it's a pretty natural time to wake up. I get up at, like, 5.30 for work on a regular basis. I just, I don't know. Today I woke up at the 2, and then I was, I, I knocked back out. Like, I cannot take pain medicine. It really does, like, screw with me. I didn't put enough pins in, and I'm kind of paying for the, quant the I guess, the consequences. The consequences of that action. <laughs> this in our scrap pile. I like to keep the scrap too, just in case I ever do something with the detail. Sewing is basically me just justifying cording. That, that's what sewing is. Hmm. I just really like to have, and it's just the most random bits of things. I need to make like a fucking Digimon or something. I just really want to have a jelly bean. <laughs> so we're making a jelly bean. Because hilariously, I have I used to have the humidity hair that you see on the model. Like I used to have that exact hair around when we started V tubing. I think that was like right after I had to dye it for work, because um, they weren't allowing you know fun, no fun allowed in engineering. But yeah, no, like I used to have that. I have this like I have every piece of the outfit on humidity I have in real life. I, I based it on clothes I had in my closet. <laughs> But I cannot complete my cosplay without a jelly bean, so we're making a fucking jelly bean. <laughs> What's up, Juan? Jelly bean from the Sitting Cuties line. <laughs> oh. Yeah, no, I'm. See, the problem is that I am young and I still have to take uh, medicine. <laughs> I just have crap jeans, is the problem. Okay, so here we go. We have these pieces, and I want to do a middle part to do the chest. The chest separates. So, like. The back will be in, but we're going to be doing a little, we're going to be doing a piece in between these two pieces so it like widens out. I sound like I know a lot more about sewing than I actually do, I swear. <laughs> so next we're going to kind of, I like to do an arrow shape. I think that's the easiest shape to really do. <laughs> oh, I want to have a job that encourages the fun. Yeah, I don't know why. It wasn't even Xenoverse that did it. I just had a massive headache. Like, I... It was negligible at the start of the stream. Like, I was good. Like, it was fine enough to ignore. But, like, at the end, it hurt so bad. I was, like... 
it was so hard to keep a line of thought. I was like, okay, we saved the kid's dog. I need to go lay down before my head falls apart. <laughs> okay, so next we're gonna do our arrow shape. Which usually, I like to do like that. And that's there. It's like for the chest shape. And then I just kind of go down. And you're gonna keep it kind of hourglass shaped. It's gonna be up here. And then we'll have it end off with arrow as well. So there's that. And what I'm gonna do, so I don't fuck this up horrifically, okay, is we're just gonna fold the fabric in half, I think. Or at the very least, we're gonna cut a part and then we're gonna cut the other part. that a lot of my sewing is by like the seat of my fucking pants do not take any of my like methods here as law because you will find a lot of people who like draft their patterns ahead on like a program or you know actually smart solutions instead of just literally cutting on the fly and going i hope it works because it worked for archon and it worked for trubbish <laughs> although trubbish was a pretty easy one because trubbish is mainly just like one shape <laughs> okay so we did that now let's yeah let's just fold this in half i think fold this in half get a pin i don't want to fold this too hard because i don't want this to like fuck up okay fold that in half have that now i can just do this There we go. Now we have our little chest piece here so Jelly Bean doesn't stay super flat. In the back in our thing. <laughs> and baconing, I wanna know what the fuck you're up to. <laughs> Here's a cook. Honestly, it's fun when you have like the stuff cause then you can feel like, oh yeah, man, look at me, I'm this character. Um, I think I've shown my necklace. Uh, where is it? Oh, it's over on my desk right now, actually. Desk, 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 desk. Where did it go? Right here. Desk, 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 desk. Yeah, no, I have the humidity necklace. Yes, yeah, like, I have most of the parts. This is more white than yellow, but... <laughs> like, oh, most of the stuff, like, I, I the shorts, I don't know if those shorts still fit me anymore. Oh, my God. I, I, I got those, and I was in, like... A freshman. I was baby. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go try that later. <laughs> or just high five. High five, bud. <laughs> Honestly, like, eat your food, kids. Eat food important. God knows I did not eat food last night. That also probably contributed to, you know, getting knocked out like that. I just, I didn't eat anything. I was just like, I gotta die now. <laughs> You will have my signature after stream. <laughs> okay, so there's those, and then I need to do Jelly Bean's legs. I don't know, do I want this to be smaller? I might make the bean a bit smaller. This isn't chibi, really. This isn't really chibi, this is a bit big. So we're gonna make this smaller. I'm making this smaller. Ow. <laughs> Uh, I saw she did that. I want to see how they did Archim because the reason I made my Archim plushie in the first place is because I really wanted one. Except um, the only one I could find that was official at the time cost $300 on Amazon and was out of stock everywhere else. And unfortunately, I, you know, I, I don't have $300 just sitting around. It was the middle of COVID. So I was quarantined at, from work for two weeks. Uh, and I said, fuck it, and I sewed an arch and plushie. I still have the pictures of the couch. The couch was destroyed. This is also a reject of Rico's body. This is a reject. <laughs> I'm sorry for having, I turned Rico away because I also just don't want to show, you know, my bird plushie his discarded extra flesh. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, God, Audie, that's a fucking mood, though. I think all I ate that day was at, I think I, you know, I ate at work. I had, like, a bagel and some hash browns at, like, ass o'clock in the morning. But, like, after that, I just died. Yeah, so let's make this smaller. Also, don't do your pins like this. This, is, this isn't this is how an idiot pins things because they want to, you know, lose their fingers. <laughs> yeah, just just don't do what I do. That's my, that's my general instruction. <laughs> so let's go ahead a bit smaller. I still want to have seam allowance. I just, it looks disproportionate to the head with seam allowance and I want to make sure we're, you know, doing this correct. There we go. I could have done a version where, you know, it could jelly bean could sit on my shoulder, but like, well, I guess I already fucking used my webcam today. God, I'm gonna get roasted. <laughs> I'm gonna finish stream and Shoji's gonna be like, you fucking moron, what's wrong with you? <laughs> well, I mean, he already knows what's wrong with me, but... <laughs> he observes me like a science project, really. <laughs> okay. Yeah, because I want this to be a little more chibi, so, like, let's get this off. Put that over there. Just enough for, like, yeah, if I put this on, that feels more cute. <laughs> that feels more accurate. <laughs> Oh, every fur fro. I forgot about fur fro. Can you do the different haircuts in the modern games? I think I saw a place where you could in like Scarlet. I just do not remember. Okay, then we have the legs and then we're done with the brown parts. So let's go ahead and get our legs started. Actually, first let me remove this like pin trap I've set for myself. This is four, this is number five. Yeah, whenever you see a custom plushie, remember this video. <laughs> remember this stream. <laughs> I mean, this is also probably going to be the stream that, like, everybody remembers, but... <laughs> this, is, this is the stream where Himidi forgot how to, you know, brain. <laughs> What's up, Jace? Honestly, mood, dude. <laughs> I cannot articulate, like, I, when I submitted, like, oh, I forgot the ears, when I submitted that final essay and, like, I closed Blackboard, I just, I had a moment of just, it's, I'm free. It's over now. I'm free. It was beautiful, really. That's the water soluble. We are not putting this fucker in the washer. Like this. A bit a bit for the seam allowance, but otherwise I think it's fine. Yeah, so about this for seam allowance. We should be good with that. We're, we're good with that for the seam allowance. There. Hmm. Ear triangle. And I'm gonna keep, actually I'm gonna keep the reject body just so I have a guideline. Right, then let's get ear number two because I forgot the cat needs to hear. There we go. I realize I'm putting on like my storybook voice without meaning to. This is my I'm concentrating voice. <laughs> Maybe that's why these are like more chill streams. Like I have to use my brain cells. I'm using my brain cells and like creating things. And I really, I really like, I love just creating stuff. It is my favorite. <laughs> I will say though, um, during summer break, I probably will still have three streams a week because I have a lot of big projects I want to get completed for the summer, but I probably will have some gorilla streams. Like that I can almost completely guarantee. Oh, I just punched my crystal. Oh no, I punched the crystal. Oh, no, that's an interesting texture. The crystals are doing fine. Um, still nothing really presentable. <laughs> the water is still, you know, going down, but... Here we go. We don't need that. We just want this so we can make another copy of the ears. So here we go. Let's make the next copy of the ears. Good rule of thumb to make things easier is just dupe everything off of the first one. It's also a good rule of thumb if you're like doing animation just so it looks similar to the original and you're not like playing a game of telephone with how you drew the lines or cut the fabric for the next one. You always wanna 
keep it as uniform as you can. I say as I aggressively cut fabric pieces without drafting a pattern ahead of time. <laughs> Bless, Ember. Bless. Oh, a giant Lapras. That'd be so cuddly. Oh my god. I start using one. One more. <laughs> I really want that. Oh god, the giant Altaria. I would kill for giant Altaria, but that is 500 fucking dollars, and I have other things I need first. What I wanted to do, actually. Oh god, before I, I got the internship, and I'm really excited about it, um, I was actually about to spend some money on a lavalier mic for, like, these kinds of streams. Just so it's, you know, maybe, like, slightly better quality than the fucking snowball, at least for cooking streams. Like, you know, I'd have it on my person instead of, like, being all over the place. Um, the issue that arose is that, you know, I need clothes that are business casual for internships. So I'm going to have to go spend that extra money on that. <laughs> and also the fact that we use personal laptops for that. And, um, as you've seen, I can't use a VTuber model that's animated when I do these streams because this laptop can't handle it. <laughs> Forgot to render your video. Oh no, I didn't. How long does it take for you to render your things? Because you have longer videos. Like, does it take a while to render or... Okay, so this is the ears. Ears are done. Okay, legs. This is gonna be the hard part for the body. Let's see. Marker, marker. Okay. I'm thinking I want the back leg. I'm going to have to do the back leg. I'm going to have to do the legs maybe in two parts. Oh, I know. I. Oh, could I use the seam as like a... Hmm. I don't want to do these. I could use a seam as a toe. If I did just like sideways like that. I could just use the seam as a toe. have ideas so for now I'm thinking I'm gonna do those I want to do those in one part I don't want those to be separate mm. so like that and then not that maybe Ditch the corner on the leg. Yeah, ditch the corner on the leg. Where did I put the lid? That's where I put the lid. Okay. So this for the legs. Well, the back legs anyways. The front legs are going to have to be different. <laughs> Let's go ahead and do this. I should mention that for felt, I hand sew, so you will not be subject to my sewing machine's noises, though I do have a sewing machine. What I want to do is I want to make cool clothes with the sewing machine, but that takes way too long. At least for, you know, just like internship. I want to do more cosplay work with it. I used to really want to do cosplay and like if the local big con is coming up soon, I just... Negative time. <laughs> yeah, I still have one I want to alter. I bought like a really cheap eBay cosplay and my goal for that was I wanted to basically redo the whole thing and just keep the pattern. You know, like replace parts with higher quality fabric, etc., etc. et cetera. Hmm. Let's go ahead and do a billion copies of this leg. We should have, we're gonna have like just enough felt. <laughs> yeah, I can just do that. Yeah, I'm trying to conserve now because I still have to do the front legs. <laughs> there we go. And I kind of want to, for the back of Jelly Bean's head. No, I can just do the, I can just do the snip and it should be fine. Should be. Rico, what did I do for you? No, Rico's head is three parts, I think. Rico, what did I do for you? Oh no, yeah, no, Rico's head is three parts because I had to make his snout long. <laughs> I forgot I had to make his snout long. G tuber montage. Oh, there's a giant Arcanine? I didn't know there's a fucking Arcanine. Although I still think I want Alteria because Alteria was one of my favorite things. 
Like, I don't know, I loved a lot of the Hoenn Pokemon growing up, although as we have seen, um, child, child Himini's, uh, taste in Pokemon was something. <laughs> really loved Tropius. It was one of my favorite Pokemon. Um, I got, like, I don't think it still exists. Like, we still have it. Like, it was at my mom's house, but, uh, I think it's gone now. I had a Tropius plushie, like the little UFO one. <laughs> and then there's, there's Tropius. That was a big one. Also, really loved Shift Tree. And um, grown up Himini is confused as to where that came from, but young Himini really loved Shift Tree. <laughs> That's one. Need three more. No, two more. Ugh. I forgot I'm holding the leg. <laughs> trying to make sure I do it in a way that like saves as much fabric as I can. Two. There you go. The scissors caught in that. <laughs> Cosplay as your YouTuber model. Honestly, I think I have to. I have to go buy another like dress shirt, which I need to do anyways for business casual. So like that's in the cards. <laughs> oh man, they didn't say anything in the dress code about hair color, although they hired me despite seeing that my hair color in my handshake picture was still the bright red. So I don't know how much they really give a shit, and I have to kind of observe them. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, they were business casual at least, so there's that. They seemed pretty business professional when I had my interview, but then again, you know, they were having an interview. I think they wanted to at least look decent. And I mean, I came in in business casual. I only could find the one sweater that, like, wasn't, you know, obscene. I had to go buy new shoes, though, because I realized I have no fucking... I had no presentable boots, so I just went and got like some cheap, um, random dressy shoes. <sighs> the problem with that is that I can barely walk in heels. <laughs> so I couldn't buy anything with heels. And the shoes are still not as comfy to me as my, you know, giant shit kickers, but they get the job done. <laughs> and a massive shiny quad star. Oh, 46 hours. Jeez. Are you make sure your program didn't de decide on its own to change what it was using to render mine did that before i decided that i didn't want to use my graphics card anymore for some reason and i had to manually fix that i was just like thanks computer love it, it takes so much faster that's actually you know using the fucking graphics card <laughs> there we go fancy as fuck or a hobo i got told i dress like a frat boy <laughs> Uh, giant Snorlax beanbag. That sounds... I don't know. I don't know how I feel about beanbags. I can't I can't tell if they're comfy or not. Maybe it's because of my joints at this point. I was just like... Oh, man. I, I, I'll sit on some beanbags. I'm just like, this is the most uncomfortable thing ever. But sometimes I'll sit on some of them and like they're really well stuffed and it just feels like comfy. It really just, just depends. It was hilarious. Oh, my God. My college's app. There's like a little like thingy the students can post messages on. This chick was selling a bean bag, and I have never seen so many, like, you know, grown adults fight over a bean bag. It's sold within minutes, and then, like, there's still people asking about, like, you know, price and size on it, <laughs> even after she marked it as sold. <laughs> College kids really like their fucking bean bags. <laughs> this, this, that's these legs. And then I am going to cheat ever so slightly. We are going to be doing the same length of leg because, you know, legs need the same length. So about here. And this is where the leg curves. Leg. Here we go. And then, what was I doing? My brain just farted. I was cutting out the piece of leg. <laughs> What's up, Cookie Gamer? We're sewing today. <laughs> okay, your 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 guild master is embegging. I'm not saying I'm going to rob them, but I am saying I want their possessions. <laughs> And 
These don't have as much seam allowance. I don't think it's going to matter too heavily though. Let's go ahead and get the other pieces cut. So stick this guy here. Why am I grabbing my sewing needles? I haven't done any sewing yet. <laughs> this might end up being a fucking two part stream, which I didn't expect. Again, like I thought I was going to sew Trubbish this morning and then um, that just didn't happen because I stuck Trubbish in a box somewhere. <laughs> At the very least, we can get a head start and get all our pieces done up. I'm really bad at, like, oh, God, I'm really bad at doing stuff just for funsies. I think it's also why I like streaming so much is, like, I it allows my terrible brain to say, oh, you're being productive by streaming, you know, because you're, you're just doing the streams. So, like, that's you'll, you'll catch me doing a lot of weird streams because I just, I want to do a thing, and I said, fuck it, you're coming along on the journey with me. <laughs> So, welcome to my twisted mind. I wanted to sew today. <laughs> Except we're not actually getting to the sewing part. We're just cutting out a billion pieces. Although I really do like self-drafting patterns more. Like, I have a bunch of, like, I've bought off Etsy for, like, I've done a couple sewing, like, for commission works. That's with Minky, though. This is just me fucking around. <laughs> with Minky work, you know, too, I also had to, like, do tests on it, too, to make sure it worked properly. And so was a bit of a pain. I still have the reference papers. Oh god, I threw those on the floor. I think I did. <laughs> in which I got annoyed that I had to keep looking on my phone for a reference, so I literally just printed out pictures of the things I was sewing so I could just look at the picture. <laughs> it was a solution. <laughs> okay, one last leg, and then we're done with the brown parts. I have our ears body, all four legs, and the head. There is no other brown part. Everything after this is with the black fabric. And that's going to be our tail and our wings, which I'm perfectly fine with. Oh, and our horns. The horns are going to try to make three-dimensional, the wings and the tail. Uh, the wings don't need to be three-dimensional at all. They're very flat. <laughs> the tail I might try to do. I don't think so in the end, though, just for comp like it's going to be complex. And I, I want this to, like Odin said, like a sitting a sitting cuties vibe. That's what I like to go with my plushies. Like I want them to look more like polka dolls than like accurate representations to some degree. <laughs> like if it, can, if it makes it look a little more chibi, I'm going to go for the, makes it look a little more chibi. <laughs> okay, just to, just to confirm and regroup. Leg, leg. Let's see. Where's, okay, it's over there. <laughs> I was about to say, how the fuck? Okay. Leg, leg. Leg, leg. Bean. That's for the head. Thing to go on the bean. It looks like I'm summoning Exodia. <laughs> head. Ear, ear. If we wanted to make a cat with no tail, we would have the pieces to make a cat with no tail. <laughs> there you go. Selling stream number one, no selling whatsoever. <laughs> Or heavy face that's sewing. <laughs> this has been the stream of my brain cells. <laughs> Let's go ahead and we'll put these guys over here. And then I'm just going to need the head and the body for references. I don't need to worry about the legs and shit. That's not, that's not relevant. These are. These pieces are. Let's put these up here, actually. Let's do the eyes first, just to get them out of the way. I don't think I'm going to make a pattern for the eyes. These are, for lack of a, this is pretty much just going to be needle sculpting, like how I did Archon's face. So, like, this is more just me not fucking up, cutting with scissors. We do any sewing. We should do some sewing. I still have I still have a good amount of time. I wanted to finish at noon and leave the house. My, my, my end my end time is a hard noon just because I have a lot of errands to run. No, this doesn't look right. I keep dropping it. <laughs> Why did I have to draw Jelly Bean with such difficult eyes? I'm gonna take off the Kirby end, I think. It doesn't need to be that pronounced. Hmm. 
Ooh, a little shorter, a little shorter. Using all of our brain cells, guys. Uh, about that. I'd say about that. <laughs> <laughs> Shall he be in the forbidden one? <laughs> The forbidden kitty cat jelly bean. <sighs> okay, that, see, now I gotta make a bunch of fucking fake Yu Gi Oh cards with just jelly beans parts. <laughs> this might be a bit too big of a pin, but we're gonna make it work. First, we don't need this anymore. It could go in the extra pile. I am very excited to own my own jelly bean. <laughs> Life pro tip. Um, if you have like a favorite show or like content creator you can't get merch of, just fucking buy like five sheets of felt and do it your fucking self. <laughs> Say fuck this system. I'm going to cut this as carefully as I can. I'm gonna have to smooth this out a bit. Go. Let's see where we're at. This is just a bit too thick. Bit too thick. Oh my god, I can't pick things up. <laughs> okay, I think this will work. I'm gonna have to vacuum or s I'm gonna have to sweep like right after this because oh my god I would piss off Tech Demon a lot because I'll sew something and then I'll forget and then he steps in a pin and he's you know he he's very understandably unhappy when he does that. <laughs> See, I'm a little harsher with these because they're gonna, you know, be the fucking face. This is the part where I'm very picky with how felt looks. <laughs> Oh, see, now I made this too. Fuck. I'm a dumbass. Okay. I think this is the best I'm gonna be able to get. <laughs> There's that. Jelly Bean has eyes. <laughs> oh my god, yes, Rock Gang archetype. <laughs> We we need to do just like a big Yu-Gi-Oh stream together. That's the next Rock Gang saga. It's just fucking Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> okay, so there's the eyes. Let's go ahead and get a start on our horns. Here we go. Horns are gonna have three parts, and they're all gonna be the same real shape, I think. Except for the back part. I'm gonna make that just like a generic triangle. But for now, I'm just gonna. Marker isn't going to really show up on this, so that's also why the parts are going to be more flat than anything, but for now I'm just going to... We're going to cut out a horn shape and go from there. So, horn... Yeah, it's mostly accurate to have jelly beans horn shapes. Maybe make the... This a little bit more pronounced. Yeah! Okay, here's Jelly Bean's horn. <laughs> there we go. Both have pets we can use. <laughs> jelly Bean is, it, a fifth grader can draw, draw Jelly Bean and honestly that's like the most important part. And I forgot that I have to do seam allowance like a fucking moron, but here we go. Let's go ahead and do our seam allowance. I honestly, it's probably more important because of the very, like, import, like, the shape of these that I have a thing I can trace back over. Although I'm probably going to have to use fabric chalk, which is a kind of a pain in the ass, but it's what happens when 
You're an idiot. <laughs> There's gonna be a decent amount of noodle sculpting for Jelly Bean. <laughs> there we go. Let's do the next horn. We need four of these, and then I'm gonna get the triangles for the third part of them to make the horns kind of, you know, three-dimensional and stand out. We're gonna have all our jelly bean parts. Then I'll probably do the, I'll needle sculpt. I think I'll get the head done today. I think I'll get the head. I think that's my end goal for the day is just to get the head done. Okay, now I need three more. It's two, do three over here. Bam. Jelly bean in the ROM hack. I will find a way. I will absolutely find a way for that Easter egg. I have a jelly bean spread. That might be like a cute little mystery gift or something, though. <laughs> Give it the same stats as like our trash cat, maybe. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's getting in the way. I might have to recut this. I'm gonna have to recut this, god damn it. Okay. That was on me. I didn't think to cut this off first and it was the bottom part was actually impeding my cutting. <laughs> so let's go ahead. Horn number two. And we're gonna have to kinda go around the pin there. Bam. A little bit closer to size. That's number two. And then this is going to be number three. We need four of these. Because the first one I didn't do seam allowance because I am a buffoon. I am a fool. I am moron incarnate. The other thing about felt is that seam rippers, um, Seam rippers can be a little aggressive, and felt is, like I said, it's like construction paper, but felt remembers, <laughs> to be, like, blunt about it. Felt fucking remembers, so, like, you have to be careful with felt. <laughs> oh, is that all four? That is all four. I'm just done. Yeah, that's all four. Okay. There's the horns. I'm just slow. Horn and horn. Now I need to do their triangles before I forget, because I totally almost forgot there. <laughs> And those aren't going to be too big. It's just enough for me to basically make the horns 3D. I'm just going to do these here. So I'm just going to grab a horn, kind of keep it next to me to keep a height reference, and then just go wha bam, wha bam for the height. Bam, bam. Come over here to do it again. So we can go the bam and the bam. And this one is slightly too tall. So I gotta go the bam. And Clonk. <laughs> Clonk. Wabonk. <laughs> and we only need one triangle per horn because it's just there to make it more three dimensional. What's your furry fans today? I don't think we missed anything. I did. Everyone just kind of appeared. <laughs> you gave Jelly Bean a boba. I. Honestly, I don't think I've ever actually had boba. <laughs> and I think I've never had it. <laughs> jelly bean in the room. <laughs> yeah, it's like, I will be putting jelly bean as like an Easter egg. Maybe like a little mystery gift or something you have to like give a code for. <laughs> yeah, I don't know I'm baconing. <laughs> What's up, Azathoth? Yeah, and I still have just like a stream to start the day before I go like do errands. What is this? Oh, that's my first piece. Apparently I just moved that out of the way. Okay, this can go over here. And then next up, we're, we're sewing jelly bean. This, we're, we have completely gotten off of where this stream was supposed to be today, but we're sewing jelly bean. 
I wanted to sew this morning, so I said, fuck it, we're sewing this morning. <laughs> I think the tail I'll do next before I start the wings, because the wings are going to be fun to cut. I don't think I'm going to make, I don't think I'm going to make the tail three-dimensional. At least I'll do, like, the base of it, but, like, I don't think I want to do too crazy with the tail. It's going to be a pain in the ass to sew as it is. I like this for a shape. About that for a shape, yeah. So then we just got to cut this again with our seam allowance. Because at some point I just kind of made this an educational stream. <laughs> I'm going to change the category to people like education, how to sew a cat. Except this is not educational because I do think I, I do everything wrong. Like genuinely, it's the kid in class who uses a math problem, but does it wrong. Oh man, I was that kid in, I, I was awful at math. I was always awful at math. They put me in remedial math though, which was a step too far apparently because I killed it in remedial math. Like. Like every other student there like had genuine problems with numbers, but I was the one who was just, I had a teacher actually stop and ask me, why are you in this class? And I was just like, cause I don't understand high level math. I can just, I, I use deductive reasoning and solve the problem that way. There we go. Okay, seam allowance number one. And then this, I don't think we can use for much else. We're gonna move that over there. We're gonna needle sculpt the smile. We're gonna needle sculpt the smile. <laughs> Stream theme, horror. <laughs> Well, be on a lookout, Justin. <laughs> okay, stop caring. Yeah, I just, I don't know, man. I just had a lot, I had a series of really bad teachers, like the very early, like core development parts of math, and then just kind of screwed me for the rest of my life. I, I still can't really do long division. I can multiply. Like I can, I can do the multiply thing, but like I just never learned long division properly. Um, the teacher who I had for that class really didn't like me and ended up getting fired, but like, oh my god, I remember one day she told me my ones were backwards and I was just like, ma'am, is this really, is, is this is really necessary? I was in the third grade. <laughs> it wasn't great, but hey man, I mean, hey, I'm kicking it. I I'm kicking it. <laughs> I don't need math anymore. I got a two-year degree and said, fuck it. <laughs> Well, I mean, I'm back for a four-year degree, but for the completely different field. <laughs> My resume looks like the diary of a madman. <laughs> because, oh God, like, I have that failed engineering degree on it. There's a bunch of stuff about, like, radio and things I've done for, like, creation and, like, you know, video editing. And then there's just, you know, just a two-year engineering degree, engineering job. Like, it, it, and there's so much randomness and I actually got asked if I could for something else if I could get it uh, certified for fire safety inspection <laughs> so I, that's going to be another thing added to the diary of a madman that is my certifications where did I put jelly beans other parts up there okay I just scared the crap out of myself <laughs> do formula Ooh, a safety compass. Hell yeah. Doodles are do do more doodling. Do more doodling. It is blessed. Okay, so I'll put these here. I'll put these on Jelly Bean's face. Do the ears here. Because now we're focusing on the wings. So like all this can go in the pile. Here we go. And then next up, we're just doing the wings. And for the wings, I'm gonna be using this side there. And the wings are just me having fun with cutting with scissors. <laughs> I just got to make that easier on myself. And then... Bam, and... Oh, bam. Okay. Jelly wing. The end is a bit long, so we have a way to put it into the seam on the back. <laughs> are you awake hey to be fair to ember there is awake and then there is awake <laughs> like i'll go to wake up tech demon and fucker he will respond to me as if he's awake 
I'll be like, okay, he's awake, and, you know, I'll fuck off. And then I come back, and he is dead asleep, and he had a full conversation with me whilst asleep. <laughs> okay. The wings are going to take up all the rest of the black belt, because now I have to do a seam allowance. So let's go ahead, and then we will start selling the face. <laughs> Go, we'll bonk, we'll donk, clonk, and we'll donk. We need four because it's so shape. Okay, now it's signature all F. <laughs> What's up, John? Forklift certified. Honestly, I'd consider it. I would consider it. I will literally, if you say, hey, hey, do you want to get a cert for free? I'm going to say, fuck yeah, I don't care what it is. I like having certifications. <laughs> I am also a certified Skywarn spotter now, which means that when the National Weather Service has severe weather and they ask for spotters, I have an advanced certification to actually, like, know exactly what kind of clouds and this also means i have a direct phone number to the national weather service that bypasses the normal chain of command hmm. like a, a, a weather person will just automatically pick up the phone for me there you go i have my amateur radio license that's a that's a fun one Like seriously, if you if you have like a random cert that I can get for free, I will fucking take the cert. Okay, so that's seam allowance number one. And then we're gonna need three more of that. We're gonna need three more of this. I can make it work if I have enough for this. Like any angle. Take these off. Or I should be able to get three out of that. I should be. Go in the pile. That's an extra piece. We don't need that. Oh, I pressed a key somewhere. I don't know what that key did, though. <laughs> oh, hell yeah, John. I still have not eaten the soup. I keep saying I'm going to eat. Like, I've been meaning to eat soup for days now, but I, I keep I, I keep having things happen. I just want to eat my fucking soup, you know? <laughs> okay, I can get... Let me do it this way. Two, three. If I do it the lengthwise way, it should be enough. Should, should, should. Okay. We're really cutting it close to the fucking wire here. Because I don't think I have any more um, black felt. Oh no, I do, I do. We're gonna see if we can just make it all work with this piece though. We already have Jelly Bean's tail. I just need the wings and we can grab the base. I need more pins. There we go. I have to sneeze and it's not happening. And it's the worst sensation. Ah. How do you how do you make yourself sneeze? How how do you make yourself sneeze? <laughs> <laughs> oh god I'm gonna die just realized that tech, tech demon asked me to send a login code to him 40 minutes ago <laughs> sorry bud I don't really look at my phone that much when I stream it's <laughs> that one and then this one I think I overpinned this I think I got a little aggressive with the pins pineapple that's how you stop, I think. That's how you stop sneeze. I want I, I want this. It did work, though. I don't have to sneeze anymore, but, like, is there a way to, like, force yourself to sneeze? There we go. Toot, toot. We're getting there. I never got surf safe certified, and I've worked in restaurants for like all of my life up till now. 
Like, I just never got serve safe. Even funnier was I got promoted at work to a position that required serve safe certification and they just never bothered to send me to the class. <laughs> I even asked about it and they were just like, you're fine, you don't need it. Which actually created, um, it was a national chain and like all of the national chain things, it was a thing across the country where they were just like lowering the requirements. And it made a lot of, you know, the old time people who've been in that position for a while mad because you had to write an essay, you had to get your serve safe, you had to have managers sign off on you, you also had to have like a certain volume of sales, like through however many shifts and still have all your side work done at the end. Like it was a very like big process you had to go through. <laughs> and just to get told at the end, like, you know, a few years later, because we were having such awful retention after COVID that no, you don't need any more. Like, that pissed a lot of people off. Remove my billion fucking pins. <laughs> I, I think I went a little too ham on the pins. There you go. <laughs> Two chopsticks and just jam it in there. <laughs> oh, I want potato soup. I have, what I have is like a vegetable soup. Like a, it's like a tomato soup with vegetables in it. And it's really good and I want it I'm hungry we should have enough with this yeah we should have enough this should, this should be fine on this last piece here we go we have our jelly bean on route here <laughs> bam bam Bam. There we go. I don't think I needed that many pins the first time. <laughs> Snorting pepper. I do not have a, f oh, I have a feather, but I don't think I want to take it off my altar for that. <laughs> the feather is, yeah, like it's on my altar and it's covered in dust. It would work. I just don't think I want to take it off my altar for that. I feel like, I, I don't know. I feel like somewhere out there, a spirit would not be happy with me for taking my fucking feather and going, yes. Snort. <laughs> That's just me, though. <laughs> there you go. I don't know. Are they good to be like, yeah, man, I remember, you know, just sometimes you gotta sneeze, bro, but I, I, I don't know. <laughs> How much do you want to chance, like, it's like if you used, like, Jesus' cross as, like, a back scratcher. You're either gonna, you know, get to forgiving Jesus, who is like, yes, we all have itchy backs sometimes, and that was all you had available. Or you could get, you know, vengeful God, who was like, why the fuck did you use my fucking symbol as a goddamn back scratcher? Like, it really just depends. <laughs> Here we go. Bam. I hate this. I hate cutting big pieces like this because it, my scissors get caught on stuff and I'm just like, please, no. I, I can't afford to recut you. I only have one last piece of 25 cent fabric. That's why I like felt. Felt is really cheap. <laughs> Here we go. It's wing one. This is wing. We need one more piece and then we're done. And we can start you know, actually sewing things instead of just cutting pieces of fabric. <laughs> just that one. Bam. The build up to a sneeze. Yeah, it's like a fucking, oh my god, it's like sneeze edging. I hate sneeze edging. Like, I just want the sneeze, please. Over. How deep is that cut? How, how long is that? Oh my god. Okay, we're fine. Oh yeah, we do have enough. Perfect. Let me just pin this now. Bam. This is basically me just giving everybody a lecture on sewing for like three hours. I'm sorry. <laughs> I like sewing. I just don't do it that often anymore. Which is sad, because I really do like it, and I like making stuff. It's like, you know, you, you can have whatever plushie you want once you learn enough. Oh, I almost forgot the fucking bean bag. That's what I almost forgot. I'll make that after I see how big the body ends up being, though, I think. 
Just have to keep some extra fabric on hand for it. Um, I like to make a little pouch of felt and then just throw some beans in there. Makes it easier than, you know, having loose beans and like a seam breaks or something. And you also have to go figure out where the fuck I put my funnel. <laughs> because you have to funnel your beads. You can't just like, well, you can just pour them in. But uh, unless you have like a mess fetish, you don't want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Miss? Ow. And of course, you know, you always have to stab yourself when sewing. It's a rule, you have to stab yourself at least once. The hardest part for me is when I actually go to th thread my needles. Um, I have glasses these size, like the size of, my dad said, the Hubble telescope. <laughs> All right, and that is the last wing. I'm gonna keep our scrap over here. Where did the body thing go? I think I threw it in the scrap pile like that on accident. It did, I did, it's right here. Okay, there's all my scrap back there. Save that off. Those are extra pieces for when I'm doing calculation. I mean, I do have one chopstick right here, but that's mainly for when I'm turning pieces inside out. Mm. So like, I could just shove it up my nose, I could, but then I'd have to wash it. <laughs> there we go, so that's wing. Let's take a inventory, <laughs> suddenly fetish talk. <laughs> <laughs> and baconing, I am intrigued. <laughs> have fun, I am intrigued. <laughs> Okay, so let's look at all of our jelly bean pieces. Wing, wing. Bam, bam. Arm. Face with horns. Here are ears for face. We have tail. Other arm. Two legs and the thingy and neck. We have all of our pieces for one jelly bean. <laughs> So yeah, roughly two hours to kind of plot out how everything, you know, will be. <laughs> but at the end of the day, you know, here's our jelly bean. We're gonna be doing a fair bit of needle sculpting for jelly bean. So like things like the smile, like the little like mark fleshy things in the toes, those are gonna be needle sculpted. Grab my sewing box here. And we're going to start exchanging some thread because I had all my, my fucking, I had my trubbish thread ready to go. We're not sewing a trubbish. Here's like a dark brown that should match. And we already have the black up there. Do I have like a bright yellow? I have like a light yellow. Here's like a bright yellow. Where's your face? Oh, kind of match. I would like a more orangey yellow though. Do I have one? Do I have orange at all? God, that's like a weird thread color. I don't think I have orange. Okay, bright yellow it is, I guess. <laughs> don't really have a matching thread for that. We already have black up there, so we have our three colors. Oh, forgot to put that back. There we go. Don't need our fabric scissors anymore. Oops. Trying to make sure I have like unnecessary stuff off the table just to save some space. We're gonna need the chopstick. Okay. Back on the floor you go, Mr. Sewing Box. Okay. Let us start sewing our jelly bean. Okay, where do I want to start? I said the face. Do I want to start with the face? Do I want to like do more nebulous things first? Well, I mean, this thread's already out, so I guess we are starting with the face. <laughs> that is a very thick needle for this. I don't want to use that one. Let's use this needle, which still has pink from Trubbish, as you can see. I'm gonna be lazy and get pieces stuck in my fucking hand. Just cut the thread, my scrap pile, bam. Now I have to, this is the part where you see how blind I am. 
<laughs> as I have to like hold the like, like right up against my face. A little life hack, by the way. If you just like moisten the end of your thread a little bit, it'll go through easier. Son of a bitch. Come on. Thread, 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 thread. God damn it. Oh my god, thread. Come on. Come on, buddy. There we go. <laughs> we got it. Don't you have a chopstick up your nose? Have, a, uh, have fun at work, Azathoth. Good luck. <laughs> Thank you for coming. <laughs> Streaming in like 12 minutes. Ah! Have fun, Black Emerald. Uh, I am going to do the face. I don't know how long I'm streaming for today. Um, this is just a nice little early morning thing before I run errands. It probably won't be too crazy long because, again, like I have a lot to do. <laughs> and I want to get it all done. I will be doing a second sewing stream, though. This is... This is fun. I have fun this on. Okay, there, and I always double knot my thread just in case. I try to make sure it stays knotted near the original knot. Also just in case. Okay. <laughs> I will see what you sent soon. I will see. For now though, let's go ahead and make Jelly Bean's face happen. Oh, I forgot about seam allowance. These are going to be too big. F. Where will they be? They might be fine. I'll keep that seam allowance roughly about there. I need to make them a little shorter. <laughs> Just a little bit, though. I fucking forgot. That was my bad. Whoopsies. Do it. Bonk, bonk. Yeah, about that. That'll work. There you go. And do I have a pin short enough? I think I have to get my other pins. Other pins, other pins. So these are like short baby pins. They come in like a variety of sizes. It just sucks when you go to, you know, take a pin out because they're very sharp. <laughs> well, they're not really smaller in size, but they're like... I, I'm bad at words. Pin. Pin. Okay. I did this in the wrong goddamn side. You made a fucking idiot. Hmm? I am just do not have a brain this morning. I think we've established that. <laughs> there. Now we pin. Because <laughs> you always do this inside out. And I did it on the side with the fucking lines like an idiot. Hmm? Although this, this should be... It should be done when the next time we sew. <laughs> there we go. So now we just sew. And because this is, it's like a more of stylistic thing, really, just how I sew things on the front. Everybody, everybody does art differently, as we've seen, you know. Make sure I'm not catching the pin. And come back out the next part. I'm trying to make it so everybody can see. <laughs> make sure your thread doesn't get tangled too bad. There you go. <sighs> Head here. <laughs> Brains are still in beta. My brain is an unreleased version that got, you know, delayed due to too many bugs. Bethesda made my brain, that's what I'm saying. Another one. I try not to do too many stitches just to keep it looking, you know, simplistic. Where is it? Yeah. 
God, I'm just really screwing up at finding. Okay, there we go. <laughs> this everything under the sun. I really am like if you randomized a sim. There's so many hobbies out there, and I want to do all of them. <laughs> like, genuinely. Uh, I've also I was an artist for uh, two different hackathon game developments. It's another fun random hobby for you to you know consider there <laughs> it was really fun one was a dating sim one was an rpg i did the graphics for them my friends were more cody i coded my own rpg it was like text-based it wasn't fully finished or anything but it was for a school project i had a lot of fun with it i think i pissed off the other students in the class i did it for though because um the second most i had over a thousand lines of code and the next highest one was a group of three people who made Battleship. I worked on my own. <laughs> I don't think this went far enough. Yeah, no, it didn't go far enough. I'm gonna try to go a little bit more up for that one. That way, I just wanted to show a little better and I always make sure that I am going kind of underneath the other piece of fabric so it doesn't aggressively look sh like jank. There we go. <laughs> the fabric likes to get caught a lot. <laughs> yeah, so like this, I, I like to do a billion things. <laughs> just me personally, I, I like to stay busy and I like to learn new stuff. So I'm just, there's a weird opportunity, I'll fucking take it. <laughs> I really want to do a breadboarding stream for everyone. I just have to figure out where I put my random breadboard. I have to like raid a micro center for some LEDs. <laughs> Honestly, Black Emerald, that sounds like a fucking power move. You show up like, look at my flash presentation. <laughs> there we go. My brother makes bread for fun. That's his hobby. It's pretty good bread. He likes to pop into stream sometimes and be himself. <laughs> he actually got the Avatar The Last Airbender cookbook. And all the air veg like all the air nomad dishes are vegetarian because they're vegetarian. I would probably be an airbender as much as I love firebenders. Yeah, so he wants to he wants to test out the airbender ones on me because, you know, I know eat the meat. <laughs> That's my hair. <laughs> Oh, go for it, Justin. I haven't seen what it is yet. Or are you talking about the... No, because you posted the surprise in the general chat. But yeah, go for it. Mm. There we go. I have not seen yet. <laughs> I try not to go on my phone too much while I'm streaming unless I'm, like, waiting for a certain message. And even then, I just kind of glance and keep going. Y'all pretty much have my full undivided attention most of the time. There we go. Because streaming is my happy time. <laughs> there we go. I hope Goodwill isn't too crowded. I need to get, you know, fancy clothes. See, sewing is so relaxing. I really do. I just love to sew. I'm like, I'll pop on a fucking movie for a little while, and it's just like the calmest thing. Just like watch like an anime or a movie as I sew. I watched, what did I watch when I was making Rico? I forget. God, that was three years ago. COVID was three years ago. Good God. Yeah, it was a fucking, I feel like a lifetime ago. What's this? There we go. We're getting, we're almost to the end of this eye. There we go. Take that pin out. We now have one eye sewed on. There we go. Hmm. 
Oh yeah, I'd eat, I'd eat the fire flakes. I love eat some, I love spicy food. <laughs> See, firebenders like their their big thing is meat, unfortunately. <laughs> like I remember Aang just kind of got some lettuce out of the trash. Which is a mood, especially when I go to restaurants. Like a lot of places don't really have anything for vegetarians, which is fair, you know. I'm not. You don't have to cater to like you know a minority of people, especially where I live. But I just I end up getting fries a lot. <laughs> okay, so now that we have our, you know, we had to tie off our thread again so it doesn't fly everywhere. Trash lettuce, yes. I love me my trash lettuce, man. As you can see, we have this here. We need to tie it off so it doesn't just unravel. And that takes dexterity that is pain. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. There we go. Once again, I always double knot everything just to be extra sure. Yeah, with felt, I just like to hand sew. Sewing machines definitely for bigger projects for this though I mean I just want to make a cat <laughs> and then I like to kind of cut these a little shorter just to just to save space there <laughs> there's eye number one as said eye number one <laughs> bearing it in like store chicken shows for me it was just the fact that avatar a lot of the episodes you could just kind of tune in and like you could still have a good time there was very little filler but like for the most part and if there's anything like massive, they would do like a recap. Ow, I just stabbed myself. And now we're doing the second die. Same as before, we're just gonna casually sew our eyes. I probably will dip around soon just so i can get my errands done i'll finish these eyes first though and then who knows i might come back later today and do more it really just depends on what i have going on go there we go it was weird i mean be fair like story like story driven stuff like not everything is for everyone there's always going to be people who have different opinions and preferences than you we can all coexist happily. <laughs> Here we go. And then there's this. Oh, no, 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 no. I refuse to let this thread tangle. It's a pain in the ass to untangle thread and half the time it's easier just to cut it and restart. <laughs> Which, again, with, with felt, felt is, felt remembers. Like an elephant, felt never forgets. It will fucking suck. Here we go. I'm gonna just... I want my own jelly bean. So I make my own jelly bean. <laughs> I'm not one of those cool YouTubers like, you know, Big Spawns who can have you two's make a plushie. <laughs> Although if I ever do somehow by some weird ass like miracle coincidence have that happen, guys, this is still the OG. <laughs> Just like you see this, you know, weird ass, you know, pattern? Use that. They're gonna be like, ma'am, please, no, it's hideous. And must be like, that's the point. Yeah, here we go. There we go. Had to kind of work around the pin there for a second. <laughs> there we go. Oh, you're good, Black Emerald. Have fun with your stream. <laughs> I didn't realize we had that much of an overlap. I apologize. <laughs> oh, fire! What, what, what is in a fire flake? I have to. I'll harass my brother. I'll, I'll send him a message because I'm very sure it's probably in that cookbook. Don't move that. Hopefully I didn't just screw myself, but it was getting caught. Mm. What's this? 
just vibing, enjoying, enjoying life, just making a jelly bean. It's a good way to start the day. Honestly, it's really nice. I recommend just like start your day by doing art. Just make something. There we go. I had to fix that a bit. The belt kind of broke. Like one slightly aggressive looking stitch as a result, but I can't really do anything about that. Oh well. <laughs> I needed I, I needed to stay on. There we go. Last little stitch. And Jelly Bean has eyes. <laughs> Funny recipes on YouTube. Yeah, it would be fun to do like a stream with the official cookbook. I'll see if I can borrow it from him. There we go. Same thing as before, we have to tie it off. Put the pin where I'm not gonna stab the crap out of myself. Bam. There we go. Bam. And we bam. I think I'm gonna do like one more to be safe. Just extra super safe. There. Same as before. I like to keep these a little shorter, just as a neatness thing. <laughs> but now Jelly Bean has eyes. I don't know why the FPS on my camera just dropped that heavily. <laughs> Have fun, Ember. Thank you for coming. <laughs> Bless y'all. Oh. My spine. Oh, I got my spine. There's face. There we go. Do I want to do any of the parts? What I'm thinking is I might come back in like the evening and like do more of this. I just gotta make sure I'm back in time. <laughs> I think for now though, I think, yeah, it's been about two hours. I need to go ahead and get dressed and get on the road. If I wanna be back in time, I'm meeting with somebody. <laughs> I have to be, I, I'm so vague about things that I saw, I swear, I, I wish I could say more things. <laughs> yeah, for now, I think this is a good stopping point. <laughs> Everyone, you know, peace out. I might be back this evening, we'll see, because I wanna keep selling my jelly bean. <laughs> For now, I'm going to go ahead and I have like four places to be today. <laughs> so peace out. Thank you for coming. Oh, I can't actually do the loading screen on this one because I don't have my laptop yet. <laughs>